takes the snap, and he's sacked immediately! And like a shot, DJ Wanham! DJ, the last time we sat down in this room was 2021 for an interview much like this one. Mm -hmm. And now you're in year four. How is DJ now different from the DJ back then? Uh, I would say a lot more mature. Uh, over the years, I've learned how to be a pro. He's a guy that doesn't get a lot of fanfare, media hype, but he is really, really good for the Vikings. What does a good pro mean to you? Uh, just the little things, like taking care of your body, uh, doing a little extra film, extra treatment time, just to make sure that you're ready for, ready to go for those game days and anything that you got. And he is sacked! DJ wanted him and DJ got him! Well, it's working because yeah. you're currently on pace to have a career season. In fact, you got your second game ball of the year against the Saints. Four tackles and a huge sack! Doing it all year, DJ Wanda. When coach calls you out like that in the middle of the whole locker room after such an emotional win, what is that like? It just shows all the work that you put in throughout the week and over the years. Um, just being able to be there for my teammates when they need me most and being able to go out there and make plays and produce uh, to allow us to, to get these wins. Well, during the Saints game, there was a moment when Daniil was breaking down the sack that you had on Derek Carr. Same for the Packers. It's a good boy. It's a specialty. He said that that was your specialty. What is your specialty? Uh, my athleticism, I think. Uh, just being able to get off the rock uh, using my speed, and then the old lineman tried to punch me. I was able to dip, on, dip under his hands and then knock his hands off of me and get the sack. And then being, being around the edge and get Carr was pretty much a, a showing of what I can do and what I'll continue to, to continue to do. Daniil's one of the best at what he does in the league. When yeah. he says things like that to you, have you ever had the moment where you sit back and you're like, wow, that's that's pretty cool. I must be doing something right. Uh, Yeah, it was like that maybe when I was like a uh, my second year in the league, but now it's just like, he knows he believes in me. Um, he's that leader, you know, somebody I can look up to and he knows when something is done right and just being able to hear him say that is like, okay, yeah, like you're getting somewhere. I want to take you back to the scoop and score in Carolina. Young being tracked down, the ball comes out, and it's picked up by Wadham. When you see that much green in front of you, it is loose. what was that moment like when you were able to run it all the way back? In that moment, once I seen the boss, I'm going to the crib, like, by any means. Um, and just like my, um, my pass and being able to catch balls and I've done it in high school and being able to when I, once I seen the ball I was like oh I'm going I'm going to score yeah it bounced right into the bounced the right into basket, my hand huh? and I said I'm <laughs> going I'm going um, but again man just being able to make that big play for my team and allow us to go out there and get that win was was big for me first NFL touchdown where is that ball now uh right now it's at the house it's sitting on this little uh, right under my TV so anybody walking they gotta see like oh yeah he scored a touchdown. With the interception. Last season, you guys were 31st in the league in total events. Right now, you're 13th. That's a huge difference. Yeah. What's changed from season to season? Uh, I think just that aggressive mindset. We attack the field like we know we're the best on the field each and every game, each and every practice. Um, so just having that mindset of knowing, like, I'm going to go out here and do what I need to do to get the job done. Um, with that aggressive mentality, like knowing like, I'm the best on the field, it's showing up in the games today.